Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Aaron Burr was born on this day, February 6, 1756, in Newark, New Jersey. In the fall of 1806, there were rumors that Burr, the former Vice President of the United States, was leading an expeditionary force down the Mississippi River. Some speculated that Burr and General James Wilkinson were planning a rebellion in the newly acquired Louisiana Territory, or that they were hoping to invade Spanish territory, even Mexico. President Thomas Jefferson warned the citizens of the Southwest Territory to be on alert for Burr's treasonable expedition. On January 10, 1807, Burr's forces, consisting of nine unarmed ships and 75 men, docked just upriver from Natchez. Fearing an invasion of the Mississippi Territory, Governor Cowles Meade called out the militia who promptly took Burr into custody. Charges of conspiracy to commit treason were brought against Burr, but the grand jury found in favor of the defendant. Burr left Natchez shortly after the hearing, but was later arrested near Mobile, Alabama. In his subsequent trial before Chief Justice John Marshall, the charges against Burr were dropped when President Thomas Jefferson refused to testify before the U.S. Supreme Court. Aaron Burr died in New York in 1836. Hi, I'm Curtis Maroney, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.